Congratulations, mate, on playing 250 games. Huge achievement. Uh, I've always watched and admired the way you've gone about it as a captain and as a player. I do remember that day, though, down at Skilled Stadium where Geelong were tagging Stephen Hill. And I thought I was going okay at the time. And you've run up to me and said, we'll never tag you five if you can't kick. Still cuts me, mate. Well done, though, on 250 games. Been asked to say a few words about my great mate Joel Selwood on the eve of his 250th game. I find words hard to describe you as a player, uh, so let me list your achievements. You're a three-time Kaji Grieve medalist, three-time premiership player. You've been voted uh, by your peers as the most courageous player in a comp four times. Uh, Six-time All-Australian. Uh, you won the Rising Star back in 2007 in your first year. Uh, and you're actually the third quickest player to reach 250 games, which is not bad um, from a boy that from Bendigo that uh, came into the competition with uh, dodgy knees. Uh, you've been a fantastic player, you're a great teammate, you're a great mate and you're a great role model. Again mate, well done on your 250 games, a huge achievement. I look forward to reflecting with you in the future on it. Sales, congrats on 250 mate, uh, obviously an amazing achievement uh, thus far. Obviously plenty more um, from what I can see to go. Um, good luck for the season. Um, my earliest memory of you is probably a unique one. I played with Scott in the under 12s Vic. Uh, and he was very proud of his older brother um, playing in the under 15s team. Uh, the way you've played has never changed. Uh, I respect you highly. I hate playing against you given the competitive you are. Um, but you're an obviously a fantastic person off the field. So all the best, mate. Congratulations on 250 games, Joel. It's an incredible effort. I think the third quickest player to ever get there. Not only that, you go down as the most courageous player I've ever seen play the game. The way you stand up for your team every time you're called on has been inspiring to watch. Love watching you play. Good luck with the milestone. Plenty more good games left in the bag. All the best. So, 250 games, uh, an incredible achievement. You've done it so quickly. You've played with incredible will, want, and desire. Uh, I've enjoyed the last 50 far more than I enjoyed the first 200 for obvious reasons. But uh, you've been an inspiration to us as teammates and, and watching from afar and playing against you um, just the same way. So congratulations, uh, here's to another 200. We Arts, congratulations mate. You deserve every accolade you're gonna get, not only this week, but for the rest of your career and post it. It's been an unbelievable ride to play with you and be captain by you, be led. Um, from such a young age, you walked in and earned the respect off everyone. Uh, your footy ability is obviously much spoken about. Um, unbelievable, mate, the way you've worked at it. You're an inspiration to everyone, not only guys that have been lucky enough to play with you like myself, and uh, every minute of every game that you've played, I've just sat back and thought, what are you doing? Um, some of the things you were able to do on the footy field, mate, it's um, inspiring. It's probably you know, it probably doesn't even do it just justice um, your actions. So well done on everything on the field, off the field. You're an absolute um, star. You're a great mate. Thank you for everything. You've you're kind-hearted and easy to talk to. You've been there for me and, and family, and uh, I just love what you've been able to do uh, for everyone involved at, at the footy club. Pretty much the broader people that you, uh, your friendship base. So well done on everything. Um, love these droopy eyes, mate. Everyone thinks you got them from your, the cuts and bruises from your stitches you got out in the field, but you've actually had them since the start. And um, you're actually looking quite good, and the hair's looking nice. If whatever you saw about that a few years ago, um, you should go and give them a bottle of rent, I reckon, because they've done a great job. Um, so well done on everything. I. Can't wait to see you for your next 50 games. I've got no doubt we'll be doing another video then. Um, and it's much deserved. Hopefully this week's speech, pre-game speech comes out okay, because at times, you know, you can stutter and um, it doesn't quite flow, but uh, you've got to be have a little bit of improvement left here for something. So, well done, mate. Um, can't wait to have a beer with you. Good luck. Selzy, congratulations on 250 games. Uh, what a super effort, uh, I think, to, to be able to play uh, at the level you've played at for such a long period of time is a true sign of a champion. Uh, I just want to say, mate, that um, 
you're someone that has taught me so much over the journey. I can still remember when you first got to the football club and uh, you know, just being as driven as you are and, and as competitive as you are, uh, I really took a lot away from that. And, uh, you still always sit back and observe the way you, you, you went about things in, in your training and your preparation on game day. Um, you truly are a, a champion football mate, but more importantly, you're a, you're a champion person. And, uh, you mean a lot to me, mate. I'm, I'm super stoked that I can uh, run out with you for your 250th game and, and uh, hopefully help you get to 300 and, and, and maybe even 350. So have a great night. I hope we can get the win for you. Love you, brother, and I'll chat to you soon. Hello, it's your old mate Ryan Crowley here from WA. I uh, didn't want to miss this opportunity on your big day uh, to send you some uh, well wishes, considering how good a relationship I've always had with the, the people and the players of Geelong. Uh, I'd love to dust the uh, old sweatbands off one last time and uh, come out and uh, follow you around on Sunday Arvo. Uh, but in all seriousness, we've had some interesting uh, handshakes with a few of your teammates over the journey, mainly you, Stevie J. Uh, but no matter how fierce our battles were, mate, you're always the first bloke over to shake my hand. I really respected that. Uh, you're a fierce competitor. You are great on the lip. I uh, really enjoyed our battles, mate. Good luck. I'll have a few off the good well. Cheers. G'day, Selzy. Congratulations on 250 games, mate. Never any doubt. Um, uh, everyone's really proud of what you've done. To see you come from an 18-year-old to become not only a great of the Cats, but uh, the AFL more broadly. Uh, there's probably never any doubt. Um, you got two massive fans in my two young fellas, Jimmy and Hugo, probably because you sent them a Joel Selwood doll when they were babies. But um, mate, we'll be watching on Sunday. You deserve every success that you've got and look forward to catching up soon. Cheers, mate. Congratulations, Jolie. 250 games. I know you can't count that high, mate, but it is an amazing milestone. The way that uh, you've played and conducted yourself throughout the journey has been huge uh, and you should be very proud of that. So. Go out, uh, play well, I'm sure the boys will get the win for you. We'll be cheering from afar over here, saying go Cats, and we love you mate, all the best. Congratulations mate on your 250th, a massive achievement. Can't wait to watch up in the grandstands on Sunday. Uh, you sucked up all the footy talent in the family, but you didn't suck up all the brains. Uh, we still remember that that great boys trip to, uh, to Mount Buller when we were heading up heading up the mountain and uh, you're sitting in the passenger seat and all of a sudden you started yelling out, oh, there's a baby bear. Oh, there's another baby bear. There's baby bears everywhere. The disappointment on your face when I had to explain to you that they weren't in fact baby bears, but they were wombats was priceless, mate. You are an idiot, but we love you, mate, and we're very proud of you and have a great game on Sunday. Well done, Skipper. Fantastic effort, mate. <clears throat> Been a true uh, Geelong champion. Um, led the boys extremely well throughout your career. Uh, one of your all-time favourites to play with. Um, always knew what you were going to get. Um, fantastic, obviously, teammate. Um, a leader, inspirational player. Um, your will to win um, and your effort um, each week is, is phenomenal. Your ability to uh, get yourself up and, and uh, to impact in big moments and big games um, is, is first class, mate. Um, obviously, a, yeah, a champion player, but also just your, your uh, values and the way you, you go about um, life and um, you know, you're always trying to make not only yourself better, but also um, teammates and also the footy club. You're always uh, looking to improve everyone around you, mate. So. Um, yeah, outstanding, outstanding player, outstanding individual and, and um, one of my all-time favourites. Um, just on a side note, just don't want to really be sitting next to you in a team meeting. Um, you can get the heavy breathing going um, through your nose, mate, so um, I'm not sure if you've been told that, but um, yeah, try to avoid sitting next to you in team meetings, but uh, well done on 250, buddy. Congratulations, Sal. 250 games, great achievement. I wasn't sure if you'd last that long just because of how hard you play the game. I didn't think your body would make it to 250 games, but it's uh, remarkable. You've done so much in your career. I still remember way back when you came and trained at the club as part of the AFL Academy, and you made a huge impression on me and all the guys then. You're only there for a week. Fortunately, we got access to you and picked you up in the draft. After, uh, later on that year and uh, the impression you made straight away, your hardness, your courage, your willingness to push yourselves, to push your teammates, make your teammates better, 
everything you absolutely love in a team, mate. Congratulations. Enjoy the game. Hopefully the boys have a win for you. Cheers, mate. G'day, Jolly Boy. Congratulations on 250 big ones, mate. You've been a great captain, a great player, and an even better bloke. Really proud of what you've achieved in your career, mate. I know there's plenty more games to come. But one thing, mate, start to look after your hygiene. Your standards are pretty low, buddy. Pick them up. All the best. Go Cats. Jolly, it doesn't seem like that long ago that you first started playing footy. My favourite memory of you is uh, when we went on a bike ride uh, out past Barwon Heads or on our way back in and I managed to clip the tyre in front of me. You flew over the top and then I think uh, Moose Wojcinski went flying over the top of you. Um, both our bikes were stuffed and uh, we had to jump in the van with Matey uh, on the way back to Geelong. Coming past the Peloton and you thought it was a great idea to hang a brown eye out the back of the van so we both did that and I've never heard you laugh so loud. But um, yeah, 250 games, uh, an amazing effort from you with the way you've played your footy. Um, you're one of those players that I'm honoured to say I've played alongside for so many years and um, no doubt you've got plenty more to come. Um, love the way that you've always been able to stand up in the big moments and uh, lift the team over the line. It's as good as I've seen from any teammate over the journey. So uh, congratulations on 250. Hope you go well and um, good luck. So just wanted to wish you all the very best, mate, in your 250th game for the Geelong Cats. Um, you've been an unbelievable player for us now, mate, for a very, very long time. And I've been lucky to play in a lot of those uh, games with you. To follow you up out the race is an absolute honour and um, something that I'm very, very humbled and proud to have done with you now for a lot of, a lot of years. So um, well done, mate. Congratulations. Uh, one on-field incident that I'll always remember, which I guess defines the way that you play the game, was at the MCG one day against Melbourne. Brad Miller coming one way, you the other, both at 100 miles an hour. You didn't flinch, eyes on the ball, took an unbelievable mark, um, just on the top of the 50, saved me a goal against, but um, just an absolute inspirational act that I guess has really defined the way that you attack and play the game, mate. So um, congratulations again. Hope it's a great day for you. And um, well done. Hey Sal, uh, congratulations on 250 games, mate. Um, massive achievement. And, uh, started way back with you in, in the under 15s, and um, definitely some some great memories along the way, mate. And uh, who thought you would have got here with with all the blood you've lost over over the years? Um, but look, mate, honestly. Um, watch from afar and admire everything you've done, mate, as a, as a person, as a player. And um, you're a great at the Geelong Footy Club, you're a great at the AFL, and I'm sure it's going to be a great weekend, mate, and, and good luck. Sal, congratulations, mate, on, uh, on your milestone. Uh, marvellous achievement, mate. I, I really love you. I've got so much admiration for you, mate. Everything that you stand for as a player and as a person, uh, you're competitive, an unbelievable teammate, a uh, fantastic competitor. Fierce desire to win. Um, hope you have a great, great night and a fantastic game, mate. And like I said before, a, a huge admiration for you and the way you've gone about your footy. Um, highly respected um, person, and yeah, I love you, mate. So good luck. Jolly, congrats on 250 games, mate. Massive achievement. Uh, third quickest in the AFL history. Um, so obviously, the way you prepare uh, is first class. You set a great example for the footy club had more achievements than you've had birthdays and you're nearly 30 so um, you know you're doing something right uh, can't wait to, to take the field with you on Sunday you're a great teammate um, I love playing with you so let's hope we get the W Tony congrats on playing 250 games um, my favorite memory with you was probably growing up when we were about four and six always getting dragged along to the supermarket with mum always asking for lollies always asking for chocolate and always getting denied. Uh, you were probably a little bit smarter than me back then and uh, used to convince me to try and steal the Freddo frogs from you, or for you, and put them in my pocket. Got caught a couple of times, but uh, all in all, I reckon we would have stolen about 250 Freddo frogs as well. So, uh, fair go to you, well done. Uh, all the best uh, for what's to come. I love being a part of the journey with you, mate. Good luck.